this is so pretty it's so beautiful but can you imagine this came from that hello friends hope you're all doing fine in today's video we're going to visit an old restaurant that's been transformed in the commercial center and i will also be meeting some chinese strangers hope this experience will answer the question that many of you have been asking me are you all right in china mine called me and said that her friend told her that here in Shanghai like in Sonja because I live in a place called Sonja there is a place where it used to be like a rice storage for the whole this whole like the whole area and then she said that place is being transformed in houses and places like where they're gonna be have like stores and other stuff and then i was like that's interesting i'd love to see that so today that's where we're going now we're going to other bus station because we can take the metro it's a little bit like it's a little bit far it's not shanghai downtown but in the suburbs of shanghai so that's where we're going today let's go and get in the bus yeah voila here we are the place looked like an industrial city in the middle of a residential area i felt like i can't wait to see what this place was going to teach us my friend's friend wasn't there yet so we decided to sit down and wait for her And then we met this guy. He was so friendly and he invited us to discover his new shop. Yeah. When the big boss saw us, she stood up and came to say hello. I was really moved. A millionaire who stands up to serve every customer. This is the best lesson I have had to experience as a young entrepreneur. Walls full of drinks from everywhere in the world. Encounter with fridges around a room full of people. Thinking that this place used to be a rice storage, it was amazing. <laughs> when we went out from the bar, we met the person we were waiting for. She suggested that we visit an art gallery first before having a tour around that place. The hall was vibrant. It was simple and beautiful. The stranger that I met a few minutes ago had become my friend. She was very happy to show me the books she had bought. 
And then she introduced me to her family with whom we were going to continue the rest of the visit together. They were so kind and they wanted to show me what they thought. And then we went for the tour. These houses were well built 70 years ago. With the rapid development of China, they've been abandoned. Now, some of them are being transformed into bars, restaurants, cafes and boutiques, and especially in art studio and art galleries. Others are going to be preserved for the history. Let's go! Bye-bye! <laughs> After the tour, our new friends invited us to have dinner with them. We went back at the bar. It was vibrant and full of people. Around the plate full of sunflower seed, we were discussing while waiting for dinner. And I was enjoying those little friendly faces and the smiles of my new friends. In today's experience, I've learned that you can take something old and transform it into something great. And I encourage you, if you have something old, transform it into something great, like how they're doing here. And I'm so grateful today. I met wonderful people. I share an experience with you. And thank you so, so much, guys, because you've been helping me so far. And yeah, I'm so grateful for your support. So now I'm going to be respectful and go back and have a meal with these wonderful people because you know I own them respect today they've been great to me okay till then see you on my next video ciao I love you